Hello everyone. Today I'm going to be looking at a very basic um, electrical generator. So we have our multimeter hooked up here to a 400 turn um, coil. This thing is pretty cool. Um, much fancier than anything I'll actually use it for, but good to have. I currently have it on the uh, DC volts. And uh, I have a screwdriver here. And um, so what we're going to do is, so there's a hole in the center of the coil here. And so basically the way, um, because this is iron based, is a 50 pound magnet, you know, I can confirm that it is indeed magnetic. And so all I'm going to do is slot it in and then out. And so that's going to change the magnetic fields. Um, and as electricity is part of the electromagnetic spectrum, ooh, fancy words. Well, magnetic is part of that, and the other half is electro. Um, basically, it's two waves at a 90 degree angle, blah, 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 blah. Anyway, so a changing magnetic field uh, produces current or voltage. So as you can see, we're producing a small amount of voltage, and the reason you see some be positive and the other be negative is dependent on the direction. So if I push in and out, you're going to have a switching current. Uh, there's a couple ways you could change this. You could have a bridge rectifier. Anyway, what if I want to do it a different way? What if I don't want to have just an, uh, an iron rod, essentially? going in and out. Well, we can go back to the magnet. Now, unfortunately, it won't go in here. But I can put it across. And as you see, we're still producing current. And I'm doing a lot less work doing this. So the other thing that's interesting is, well, a motor is the exact same thing, but in reverse. So effectively, if I put enough electricity in this, I could make the I could make this rotate. Well, kind of the brush. There aren't brushes here, but you know, generally yes. If I put electricity through here, then I could make this an electromagnetic magnet. Sorry, which is like this, which is a uh, ferrous magnet. Um, so yeah, that's fundamental of how a generator works. Electrical generator. It's pretty simple. Pretty cool. Um, Coils are cool to mess with. They're cool in radio and electronics. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.